Wait, what? Oh, they're gonna end right. They're trying to end the game. Oh, they, guys, rush the wolf, rush the wolf. Wait, why did they even clean the way? Why didn't you just go? Oh, rule the way. Yeah, okay. Oh my god, Jackie's gonna win. They're actually gonna win this game, by the way. Oh, it's gonna be the way. Why are they trying to kill Drake, by the way? It's over. It's over. They're winning. They're coming, Archie. I told you. <laughs> I knew it. Oh my god. Gosh, just run and tell I called 3 1. I called 3 1. But you know, oh, poor you know my, I, I probably lost like 50, 50 uh, brain cells right there. Yeah, you hit your fucking head on the fucking so, couch. So if I eat next week, if I, if I don't play, if, I, if we can't win anymore, then we know why. At least they're playing the game. <laughs> you head okay, buddy? You okay up there? And if anyone looks at my message for you, then it's because I got hit my head, my head right now. Ah! And everything happened after. I Some guy me. messaged me asking. We've been, uh, I wouldn't really say chilling the last weeks because we've been practicing pretty much every day, but it has been a bit more chill in a way because we are kind of playing without pressure now since we're all really qualified for Worlds and that has really impacted the mood here at, in our team really positively. When I always played Summer, it was a lot more about making it to Worlds and qualifying for it. And it was always like winning Summer is like a bonus. The main goal for every team is making it to Worlds and performing at Worlds. Right? Oh, what's gonna happen if we don't make it? Or are we gonna end up in Gauntlet and all that? But now we already made it through. And obviously we still wanna make first, right? But having that added pressure gone now is, is really nice. So we're, we're just chilling and the mood is good here. What? Why don't you have a bar to set? Um, because I don't like buying items that don't give damage. <laughs> <laughs> it was a joke though. Yeah. That will happen against. Uh, yeah, I beat them. At uh, MSI? What are you doing with the Curses? Are you playing well? Yeah, I mean, that game was something else. There were some, some in draft errors of the game last year. <laughs> some draft errors. Caps last year didn't get a haircut for the entire season. He got one at the beginning of spring and then went all through Worlds. And by the end of the Worlds, uh, his hair was pretty long. So we're trying to get Caps a haircut before playoffs this time. It seems like a reasonable, you know, look nice for playoffs and have a haircut for Worlds. Where do you mean Caps are going? Before nice. quarterfinals. We have a haircut date. Before quarterfinals? We didn't make semi it. Semi-finals, sorry. You made a blood pack. Yeah, we have a blood pack. You made a blood pack. Yes, we, yes, we did make a blood pack. I told you. There was a blood pack. Before playoffs, we were going to get a haircut. We didn't make a blood pack. You said, okay, this was like a few weeks ago. So we were going before semis. I need a haircut. This is getting really disgusting. Do you have a... Documentation of that? No, I don't. I don't have any proof. <laughs> oh, keep it mm -hmm. Verbal, well, verbal contracts nothing. can be binding. Yeah, yes, yeah, but he has to be able to prove it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah well, as a witness. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't believe you. Unfortunate. I, wit I witnessed the whole. Uh, the whole oh, I, have a, I have a witness. I bring Soaz to the sand. <laughs> Soaz, uh, did you want uh, <laughs> air caps? Agree to go into. Yeah, what was my exact words and what was Dylan's exact words? Objection! <laughs> Caps exact words was yes we can. Was yes we words. can. <laughs> yes we can. I find that to be inaccurate. Doesn't seem like something I would say. I think he, he looks way better with short hair. Like people can, like I mean, it's like really night and day. In my opinion, you know, like he looks really like a hobo. But, his hair, it looks like it's, I mean, I, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just, it's not good. I think Caps' hair is uh, beautiful and hopefully he will keep it growing for a few more months so he can end up with a ponytail or, you know, something really, really cute. I mean, I don't know why, why would Caps cut his hair. I mean, cutting his hair is not going to make him a better Yasuo player, right? It's poggers actually, it's actually poggers. <laughs> Wait, look at your hair! <laughs> oh my God. I thought they were gonna trim it. 
Yeah, well, whenever, Cubs, whenever Cubs gets a haircut, he always goes like, it's really short. Of course. Yeah, it's then there's a long time. He's like, like once a year. Yeah. Then there's a long time where I don't have to. Why are you touching your hair like this, Cubs? I'm just testing my new hair, you know? Yeah, testing. Yeah, no, I always do that. When you have a new haircut, you always yeah, feel yeah, like you're going to go like this. You're like, I didn't actually look at how it looks. I don't know how it looks. Maybe it looks good. But why are you just... You just... It looks, it looks fine. It looks really short though. It looks like one week too short. So you did it about right. I'm gonna play tomorrow. Who cares? What are we doing tomorrow? Who's this? This is Martin. This is Superman. <laughs> you should have seen the amount of hair that there was. It was like a when big got cut. Man. It was like this giant mound of hair. They can I took a picture of it. You did it. What? You took a picture of it? Yeah, I just saw a picture because there was like this. Huge pile of hair on his back. No, but that's all the skill. All, all the skill is gone. If yeah. I, if I all the skill. No, you cut off the int. Yeah. <laughs> you cut off the yeah. int. Yeah. That, that's all the losses to RNG. Like all gone. Prep for Misfits actually is going extremely well. Um, we have multiple rosters that are performing super good in scrims, so we feel like we have a really good chance of winning going into the series. Comparing now to last time we played Misfits is a little different because last time we were the underdogs in a way because they were 9-0 and they were undefeated, no team had beat them yet and that meant our preparation actually ended up being absolutely crazy and we, we were so well prepared coming into the game and it really showed like we, we won that game pretty, pretty cleanly. I would say that we are favorites coming into the match, but of course like you can never underestimate a, a good team and especially that there is a lot on, on the line to, to win the split. So I would say that the team and myself are, are confident in, in our capabilities in winning the, the best of five, but anything can happen, it's a best of five, so. Misfits has shown like a pretty particular play style in their quarterfinals match. They're playing heavily to bot side um, and they had a couple of really good early game plans. So that's what we're primarily looking at. That being said, they in the past have like completely switched up their strategy for a best of five series. So we're looking at what they did in quarterfinals, but also trying to look at ourselves as well and make sure our strategy itself is kind of rock solid. So I think if both teams end up pulling out their secret picks and secret strategies, then it can end up being a really, really crazy and a fancy series. Whippo goes in with the charge and now Alfari's in a very good spot, shielded up, Whippo trying to turn this one around with Maxwell looking for the route, Alfari running away, the flash for oh, Isaac survives for the moment, Maxwell's in the midst of all the minions, the bellows back to Whippo, gets the 2v1, could be a very early dive here from Fnatic, Alfari jumps in, they're trying to turn it onto Whippo, he gets one, oh another fight kicks off, Rachel Fisher used Mickey, tries to turn it back around onto Killersang though, he puts up the unbreakable, the wall between Fnatic and Misfits, Chocwave only gets a one, Hans Simon needs to get out of this because that Braun passive is going to do a huge amount of work. There's one. Sekos flashes straight into the arms of oh! Reckless. It's flashing forward. Reckless comes back for playoffs. He gets one. There's the second. Superb stuff for Fnatic. Comes the Ram once again onto that back line. Mickey trying to do what he can just to keep the rest of Misfits alive, but they can jump towards Alfari. Reckless with a long range crit. Whippo with the knockup. Alfari not in a good spot at all. The Chogat's done for, and maybe so are Misfits hopes. Reckless! Holy moly, that's a lot of damage! Fnatic strike burst, they're gonna team fight their way to victory and take a one-up lead. Our haircut carries. <laughs> they all have a new haircut. Yeah. <laughs> they all... Sang uses him as a conduit. Mickey looking for the knockback here. Concussive blows is gonna land. There's the stun. Teleport coming in behind them, but Fnatic are gonna answer with one of their own. Oh, it's done! And Summer gets first blood, and here comes Alfari. Teleport cancelled by Whippo. Incredible stuff for Misfits. They get their bot lane ahead. We'll be able to get Hillsang. Alfari jumps in. Hillsang down now. Alfari turns it back around. Mickey is still alive in the midst of it all. Hans Sama goes legendary. The first Nexus Tower goes down, and Misfits have put all of their eggs in the Hans Sama basket. They put their faith in Callisto, and that faith paid off. It's Actually, like... Also, he did, uh, he did a standard level one. He picked it at the ramp. He did a ghost moro in top right. Like, uh, there's a high probability of seeing the... Uh, could see the corky again. Yeah, corky again. Whoa! Oh, that's a vein mid lane! Into a Galio? <laughs> I know I made the statement before that Caps can play everything. I did not expect a mid. Just need
Need it one more tower shot. Hunt Summer jumps forward. That's it. Oh, 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 Hunt Summer has the reset. Hunt Summer. You can tell. He can taste it. You can tell. He wants to go for it. Alfari coming in behind them all now. Here is Senko. It's a very positive. Unstoppable on short. Slut shut down. On to Caps. Getting on to Alfari. Oh, oh, Three-man knock-up. Heroes entrance comes in. Another three-man Caps. Caps. Killed Hunt Summer. This was the most free win the game is playing ever. So I was sitting there, I was zero one, I was zero one, I was like, Dylan really hates me now. Dylan, and now I can't, I was actually thinking like, well now I can't say that every time I say a random pick it's good, but then it was good, I don't know. But Ellie Blank would have been perfect. I was like, I was like, it's the only champion in the game that would have turned up fighter around. It's the only champion in the game. And someone was like, someone was like, I think it's lost. Someone's done the win! And then you actually won Charlie. When all I ran at you, you won Charlie. <laughs> so I feel like <laughs> they will destroy you. It's the time for Oxen Born to make him quick trade, but Mickey is ready. Puts down the shield, unbreakable. Hill is there as well, doing a lot of damage to Hans Summer. The Ignite comes out as well. One last auto isn't going to be enough. Caps, Caps is on his way down. Hans Summer has the heal and flash. Caps. Flash in, ignite straight away as well. The heal's not going to be enough. Hunt Summer down. Five man strong. Reckless on his way as well. There goes the rift held. Secured. Brox in the back of the pit. They on the hunt. Use Caps jumps in. Maxwell solo. Ignited. Jumps away. Brox is still in the midst of it all. Is so, so lone. Hillisang's doing a lot of work. He's on Senkoks. Caps has the flank here as well. Nikki dead. That's one for one trade. But Caps got a double. Everyone's just dying. Summer is still alive in the midst of this all. Reckless there as well. Alfari running forward. You can see that Misfits want to do something now, they have the advantage. Caps jumps in onto Hans Summer, but the concussive blows are just looking for the stun lock. Hans Summer ignited, he's done! That definitely sucks. Caps two versus Caps one. in the 2v1, a double. Oh, and they they and now Maxwell's caught underneath the tower as well. Hillsack knocked him back. One more shot would be enough. Maxwell survives for the moment. Teleport coming in as well. A triple kill to Caps. And whenever you get into this situation against Fnatic, you have to remember how every single one of their players is impeccable. Caps gets his 10th kill of the game and Fnatic are not done. Soaz going for the dive, Mickey going back to the fountain, followed by Alfari. Misfits are routed in the mid lane and Fnatic are going for the base. And this mid lane performance is insane. <laughs> I think we had a really bad throwing in game two, but after losing to you all, I'm glad we didn't leave Berlin on a bad taste. You know, like we did fighting on three, and then and now my ear hurts me. It was so hard. Oh, my right ear, yes. Who was on your right? I think Bipo. What? Motherfucker. What the fuck are you blaming me? What yeah, the hell? You, you no, I wasn't. Was Look, well, we're, gonna, we're gonna check the vault. Uh, uh, we're gonna check the vault and I'm gonna report you if it wasn't me.